Two patients from the same family in England have tested positive for coronavirus. The first cases to be recorded in Britain. The number of worldwide cases of this new virus has now surpassed the numbers in the 2003 SARS epidemic. Chinese officials say more than 200 people have now died, mostly in Hubei province where the virus emerged with almost 10,000 cases now reported nationally. Earlier, I spoke to Robin Brandt, who's in Shanghai. Well, it continues to spread uh, at a rate uh, every day uh, that is consistent with it just growing and growing at about 25 or 30 percent. We've seen these figures uh, across every day this week. Uh, today, the Chinese official government figures 213 people are dead. That's up about 25 percent on yesterday. Uh, the number of confirmed cases of people infected just under 10,000. That's up 20,000, uh, 20 percent rather roughly. And suspected cases, uh, that's around 15,000 up 25 percent. So we're seeing this double digit increase consistently almost daily uh, this week. So that suggests clearly uh, that the spread continues and continues at a rate that the Chinese officials are struggling uh, to contain. Nonetheless, uh, Hubei province and its capital Wuhan, which is the epicenter city of this outbreak, uh, that city remains effectively shut off uh, to the outside world. It's very difficult to get in. It's very difficult to get out. There is enforced quarantine team for some people there, an intense medical effort as well. But what we're seeing in other parts of Wuhan, a city of 10 million people, is being replicated in other cities as well, a kind of a, a self-enforced quarantine. People just aren't going out. Uh, there's obviously a concern about, uh, uh, about getting this virus. And also there's just a broadly a concern about interacting with other people. That's even being replicated here in Shanghai, a thousand kilometres away. This city is very, very quiet at the moment, uh, barely uh, a soul on the streets. And we're expecting this weekend for the end of the Chinese Lunar New Year Festival, a time when tens and tens of millions of people are supposed to get back on planes and trains and come home. That will be a big concern because the worry is that will just uh, unleash another bigger potential for this virus to spread in this country. Robin Brandt in Shanghai there.